it, Robbie. We're in Claremont right now for game two of the doubleheader. How are you looking to perform today? And is there anything specific that you wanted to do? No, just treat it like another game. You know, obviously I expect a lot from myself and I want to perform well and I want to go five for five, but you know, you gotta be realistic. So uh, just hopefully have a good game and perform well and yeah, get a get a dub. All right. And if baseball wasn't a part of your life, what would be your dream job? Dream job. Actually, uh, I want to be a uh, biomedical uh, engineer, okay. so I'd like to make prosthetics for, you know, less fortunate kids. Wow. <laughs> yeah. And which MLB team do you think has the coolest uniforms? Coolest uniforms. Kind of a tough one. Um, I'd go the baby blue Cardinals. Okay. I think that's the sweetest uniform. Nice. I like it. I can dig those. All right. Thank you. No problem. Softball, long throw, got him, nice. Hey, Robbie, you guys won 13 to seven today. How do you approach the plate when you already have such a big lead? Uh, I just gotta stay focused on the pitcher, what he's throwing, and stay with your approach. You can't leak and uh, you know, try to go yard or anything like that. And so I think that's kind of what happened with my later at bats, tried to get big and ended up paying for it. And you walked twice today. How do you see the strike zone so well? Uh, I, I think it's like, honestly a gift. I used to be a pitcher actually, so that might have helped a little bit, but um, just tracking the ball from the pitcher's hand all the way to the plate and practicing and getting more and more, more reps really helps. That's nice. And you also had a sack fly that got a run in. That may not help your batting average, but it does help the game. How important is that to you? Uh, super important. That's just you know the way the game's played. Uh, the best go out there and do that every day in the pros. Then, you know, I, I, I might as well be grateful and do it here too. So. Nice. And what are you hoping to take from today into Saturday's doubleheader? Uh, just stay hot. Um, definitely keep the bats rolling. We had a lot of hits. And, uh, yeah, just keep the winning streak going. Okay, thank you. That's going to today. Thank you. So, Robbie walked twice today and reached base once on his own. What do you have to say about his ability to see the strike zone? He's really good at that. That's why we keep him at that two spot. I mean, Robbie is, is a tough out. It's a tough out. He's not lacing the ball in the gap. Or he's not lacing the ball right at somebody. Um, he's going to see about four to five pitches. And it's not by design. It's not like he's up there saying, I need to see five or six pitches. It's really just kind of like, I need to find a pitch I can hit. Um, and if you don't give it to me, I'm willing to wait. And I don't mind going to two strikes because I'm not worried about you carrying me up. I'm going to make contact. So that's stellar for us. And that's why he stays in that two hole. And really, he becomes a catalyst in the lineup. Once Nolan gets on and then Robbie's right there, we'll, we get to play baseball. I think earlier today he got a bunt down, uh, even though I gave him a green light to swing it. Uh, he puts a bunt down, gets a great placement, and he gets a hit out of it and, you know, gets the game rolling and got bases loaded nobody out. So I love having him there. He's a prototypical two guy, um, and he does a great job with it. And he had an error later in the game, which isn't really typical of him. How do you think he handled that in the moment? Uh, yeah, I don't think it bothered him one bit. Um, you know, like you said, it's not typical. So usually, like, someone – who does something that's not typical, it usually doesn't bother him. Because it's like, hey, if I know that I'm a guy and, and I made a mistake, I'm not going to dwell on it because 98% of the time, 99% of the time, I'm going to make that play. So it's just kind of like, ah, we'll just chalk it up to an L. Uh, let's get better the next time. Nice. And Robbie also scored three times today. What have you guys talked about to kind of make sure that he gets across the plate? Uh, Robbie's just kind of on that same page as Nolan. And, you know, he, he's a good base runner. Um, you know, he knows the dirt ball reads really well. And he can pick out pitches to still want. So, and he can actually run a little bit. So, kind of the same thing. You know, those two guys get on, you're in trouble because we follow a big road after that. 
and Tommy Acuna has been coming on hot. So, you yeah. know, our lineup. And then with EJ coming back, Elijah Johnson coming back, you know, uh, we're, we're really looking real looking nice. So uh, Robbie and Nolan would do a great job setting the table. All right. Thank you. All right, thank you.